right there. Can you see it? Right there. That is definitely a massive portal or a massive flying saucer hovering right there in front of the southern camera, the south view where the observatories are in Hawaii. You can see the curvature of the rim at the top. There is no doubt at this point, none, none, none in my mind at all. People want to dismiss this bright glow that was in the sky as the volcano. No, 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 don't, no, D you can't. You no longer can dismiss it. The scientists and the governmental officials they know what's hovering in that sky right there. They know. Their vehicles have been all over this place. All over the place. This is not the moon. Okay. This is not the sun. This is not the volcano up there in the sky. This is either a massive portal or a massive flying saucer. Whatever it is, it has clearly defined curvatures curvatures look how massive it is and it's light its light is so bright let me make sure i'm on here its light is so bright hello susan b hello everyone thank you for joining you this is groundbreaking this is you know we know that we've been seeing stuff at the observatories we know this i know it and you know it okay we know it let me show you this let me scoot myself to the side. I am. I'm going to blow it up. <laughs> We're going to blow it up so you can see the curvature. Can you see the curvature? Let me almost make myself shrink just a tad bit. I'm going to bring myself over the curvature that is up here. It's right here. Perfect defined edge. Just like this. At the observatory in Hawaii. Now... I don't know if maybe a portal would be slanted like that. Um, it's extremely, extremely bright. There's been all kinds of lights flashing at the observatories, you all. It's either a massive portal or a massive UFO. And the scientists, you know the scientists who have been there all these years, know that something is up. They know. They know. And it happened right around the time the uh, volcanoes started to do their eruptions. We watched it, you all. On the south view camera, the southern view cameras, there's been a super bright light. And um, our first impression really is the right impression. It's, it's not the volcano. It's not... It's uh, UFO activity, portal activity. You can see the timestamp 551. Oh, one right here and we can go over there if that's what you want to do you go over there and you check it out for yourself you others it's right here so if it's right here who does it belong to who what race of beings has it because there's been some flashing lights there's been all of this kind of stuff going on you all all kinds of it let me um let me come over here. I want to see the comments. I, I know the moderators are good. We try not to block comments. We really try not to at all. We try to let you have your opinion. We do. Um, yeah, I've been looking. I've been waiting. I was sitting in front of the fireplace and it was right there. I, I got my laptop out and I thought, I know it's there. And boom, went right to it. Yeah, went right to it, you all. Uh, we're going to go to there. Um, to the observatories and I'm gonna let you see I am you're gonna let you see it um, if you have, let me see this um, we can do it you all we going to let me I may not have to go all the way over there um, let me see you all I may not have to all the way well I'm first I'm going to show you all the bright lights that's been going on we can go to this one right here I'm going to show you all the bright lights that's been going on. So this is what it looks like. But we will officially go over there and we will look at it ourselves. Uh, this is the, the, no, that's the north view. I don't want the north view. I want the south view. 
See, this is the south view facing camera. See how these lights look at the rings over here and here. They're coming from up there. They're being, and this right here, we watched it yesterday. Was it yesterday? It, it stayed up for around 20 minutes, that bright light. I think something came down. But at the time stamp, 551 is uh, when the perfect looking um, signature comes where you can see the realm of either the portal and or the UFO. Look how, look how, look at this. If it's a portal, something's coming through. And there are, there is something flying around this area. You are, it looks, it does look like it's spinning to me. It really does up there in the sky. And see how that came on all of a sudden? And then boom, it disappeared. I'm trying to get to, it's, it's one o'clock in the morning. Now, if we were to go to the observatories, you won't see, you won't see it slow down this fast. You won't, or this slow, because it's such a time lapse. Is, um, see, over here on the side, there's ships. There's long white ships over here. I don't know if you can see them, but they're setting right here on the side. I mean, I mean, it's probably too, um, too hard for you to see them. Y'all, let me put this back to me. I'm going to so, show you these, um, there are long white ships. They're sitting right here. Can you see them? Right here in the sky. These aren't clouds, but they're literally setting outside this great big thing right here. And even look like it has like, um, it, it really quite possibly could be a massive flying saucer. It really could. Let's go back to this. So I wanted to show you that because, uh, okay, now they're backing off. Okay, they're backing off. Can you see them? They back off too. I'm supposed to be at the timestamp 5:51 is when it happens. There's been a lot of bright lights. Okay, that looks like it would be a car going down the road. But let's get to it. Yeah, it's it's curving and it's not the volcano's light. You can see it spinning. Look how it spins up there. Oh, it's almost it's almost a perfect circle too. It's three something in the morning. All right, let's try to get it. I first got it on my laptop and when I came up here I couldn't get it on my great big computer. I said don't tell me that they have already changed something on it before I could actually get it on my big computer. See look how it's curving right there. That And it's not the moon you are. We're at 4 o'clock in the morning 4.44.01 and this thing is still up there right in the southern view high up in the sky and it's spinning. It's spinning around and if See, that's no. Something came down. Something did that. It, it blinds you. If anybody, if, if you have been, if you have been like abducted and you had missing time, everyone who has practically have seen a great big blinding light come at them. It, lit, it is so blinding. And this thing right up here in the sky, it's absolutely blinding. It's blinding you all. These UFOs that do that, they will blind you and you will have missing time. When you come back through, you won't know. You will not know. Let's go back to that. I'm trying to get to the 551 if I can't get it to show up on this um, right here. My graphics are so um, powerful on this big computer right here that I'm using that, um, okay, this here, you got it, got it, we got it. We have got it you all you got it can you see it don't tell me i didn't flip the button right there 551 you all we saw it together can you see it right there mm. we got it right there okay you all see we can we can even take a screenshot to show you that it's right there the curvature and all right up there at the top so watch this you all right up here see it there it is right up there perfect curvature and look we went through the thing frame by frame what little frame we had it's there you are up there in the sky and it's not the volcano somebody's trying to come up with a cover story but a volcano is not that good of a cover story for something up there in the sky it's yes you can see it all you sure can see it right there. You're right. You're right. There is the windows right there. Boom on the side. 
That's right. Is that what you saw? Frank Cooper? Right there? Is that what you're talking about? That one spot? Yeah. Okay, so we got it. Yes, Polly, honey, you see it. You all can see it. You can see it now. Right up there, you all. Even if we were to, let's see if we could do this, if we darkened it a tad bit and did this. Yeah, you can see the windows right there. And it's like, isn't that interesting that we, we covered these great big round like UFO like things with rings. But then we showed one that had a window in it too. You all look at that. They are. So it is a massive flying saucer like. Yes, it is round you all. It is completely round. And it's at the observatories. And it has been there uh, ever since the volcano went off. Or a few days afterward. It's, that's how long it's been here. Well, there's one. This is the big mothership right here. You can see it. Yeah, you all see it. Um, <sighs> yeah. I think there's a reason why um, I had some opposition from the negative coming at me today. The negative rim tried to distract me so that I wouldn't be able to focus and go to the observatories and find this. It really did. It tried to get my mind out of focus. This is at the observatories. The scientists know. They know that it's there. They know it's there and they're not saying nothing. The governmental officials, they know it's here too. They know. They all, they all know. You can see it right here. Even if we were to blow it up like this, you all, you can see it up there. This is the original timestamp right here. And um, you can see it down here. 55101 on the 4th. It also shows back up in the sky. It don't go nowhere. Well, it fly, It moves in a little location is what it does. It moves a little bit. But yeah, you all, this is, um, it, it's real. And this, um, how... Are they just going to ignore this and not tell the people? Are they? Are they not going to tell the people what's going on? What really is going on? You are. It's going to cause mass panic. It is because people aren't prepared. They're not. It's okay. We can we can um, we can look at this again. You all. We can see down here. Make sure we're on here. What else I noticed too is there were rings up here. There are rings that show up too on this area. So look how it does the flashing. The light is so bright. It's extreme. What else do they need to do to get their attention? You are. Am I on here? Um, I, I, okay, I'm on here. I'm just wondering, am I showing up on here also? You are. What do they need to get the attention? They're, they're literally right in front of the cameras. They are. Look at that right there okay so then we go we do and the, the trucks are up there too they are up there there we are 55202 now it's 55202 and it's still you can see the outline of it you all at 55202 the outline can still be seen um right here 55202 boom on the southern camera, right up here in the sky, you can see the outline. Alien Garu. Yes, they did. Thank you. They did. Um, you can still see it. Uh, that's right. Well, you can demand, Michael, honey, all you want. That don't mean that they're going to give it. But it's going to have to get out. It is going to have to get out, you all. It, it is spinning around in the sky, too. So look at this. So see, there's the other. Look at this. That exact light was just over there. And now it's there. And it makes it look like it's coming from a vehicle. But you know, that could be a ship up there too. With the super bright light. Okay, it's gone. Whatever it is, it's, it's moved. Oh, it's coming back. You see it? It's coming back. Uh-uh. So I see somebody walking. Oh, they're there. They are watching you all. The trucks, they know exactly what's going on. Are they terrified? Really, are they terrified? We we, we can go up there and we can um, talk.
talk to them. I can go up there and talk to them. They'd probably listen to me. They probably would. Um, that's right. So you can see some ships in the sea. It's, see, it's not there in that spot, but you can see the ships. There's white ships, too. It's a flying saucer. So it's like, um, we can see it. Yeah, I just want to do it like this so you can see what's going on. The, the officials are up there. The scientists are up there. Okay, so now I, here we are again. It's uh, one minute past midnight on the 4th. Right here, one minute past midnight. And here is that super bright light. Okay, can you see on the sides here? Um, it's like um, smaller disks. It is. They should not be able to reflect all the way over like they are, like from this location right here, you see. It's reflecting here on its side. And then over here also there is a reflection of it while wow, this is still up in the sky. Let's keep going. Because um, this stayed there for like 20 minutes and then it disappeared. Um, see, that's a big bright light. See there, look at that. Looks like a vehicle coming. It's 2 in the morning, you all. They know something's on. I bet they don't know what to do. The scientists probably cannot open their mouth. They probably can't open their mouth at all. Or are they going to get themselves in trouble? They'll probably lose their job. It has to be a controlled... If you're just turning in, they are, they're here, they really are. Now, as this gets across up in the sky, you all, there's, there's been lots of vehicles here. So many vehicles. As this gets around, somebody said something about the 8th. They did. Who was it on here that said something about disclosure on the 8th of uh, December? Somebody said something. Okay. So that's the sun up there in the sky. Okay, it is way up there. You can see it reflecting on the top of the observatories. And the sun goes over there to that spot. Okay, you see it. It's going over to that spot. That's the sun going down. And here it comes back. Uh, it's 1900 at night. 1900. So it's 740 at night. And here it is again. Do you think it stayed in that place? Wow, my gosh. Are you seeing what I'm seeing, you all? Look at this. Right here. Look at this right here on the side. It looks like um, a structure, a great big massive structure with windows and um, sides to it. This looks like a gigantic, gigantic ship right there. It does. A gigantic ship. Totally gigantic. That's at timestamp um, 1204 at 2011 and 01. 2011 and 01. You can see it. Oh my gosh, it's got even bigger windows, you all. Even bigger windows. Look, there's more to it. Can you see the more to it right there? It's like two levels. One down here, one up there. And it stretches all the way over to here also. This thing is massive, and it's got like a, a black ship or something right here attached to it. I, don't, I won't be on here too long because I don't want to, I don't like making it a long video because people don't want to, some people don't want to see you all. Look, that is a massive ship coming through. It is enormous. Okay. There, it's getting bright again. Okay, it's still spinning around. I think some of these ships that are coming through, they're blocking some of the radiance. Okay, here we got this one thing again. Bright light. Right like that. 
Okay, now see what here's the look. Look on the top of the observatories. I think that the the ship it moved from that location right there because on the top of the observatory you'll see the light from it. It it goes up higher in the sky. It looks like it's going to go up higher in the sky. There it is at the top. And it, I don't think it could be the moon because the moon don't rise in the north. Okay, it doesn't. It's flying around the observatories. It really is. It's circling the observatory, you all. That's what it looks like it's doing. If you're just tuning in because this is um, this is at the observatories. You say, Gina, how can we get there? Let me show you how you can get there right here yeah you did it is um yes angela it is a gigantic structure we're over here at the canada france hawaii telescope they got pretty cool images they do but it's this one right here it's the south view facing camera this is the time lapse from the fourth see how it's so bright it, it would be blinding if you were down there it's that bright and the scientists the, I, they don't know what they're going to do they really don't remember when that big black ship showed up um november the second it's been around one month it showed up at the observatories the great big black ship now here it is again when we go over, we'll go to the cloud cam and you'll be able to see down below on the other cloud cam camera, you'll be able to see, you might be able to get a northwest over here um, on the cloud cam on the south facing view. Is that this? This is, n I can't, no, that's the east view. This is the one you this is south facing i can't really see southwest views you can see the observatories over there on the side they're kind of shiny on, on the top see the bright light it's in the sky it's on the fourth at 20 hundred at night and um, we caught a ship around there at the bottom part a long white ship is this showing you all because we're trying to see we can't get a good view they must have changed their camera Wait. Was this the camera that I s said yesterday? They need to fix their camera because it's so blurred. Was this the camera that we said they need to fix? Well, they fixed it because it ain't blurred no more. It's bright. It looks kind of clear. Look at it. Look at it, you all. It didn't go away. This was the camera. Wow, they fixed their camera, you all. I'll make sure they fixed the right camera. They did, you all, because we mentioned it, that that camera needed cleaned. I think that's wonderful they fixed it. Thank you, because we like to look at clean cameras. That's the first time it's been cleaned since I've started looking at it for the past few years. Have you been there? Yes, eyes wide open. Have you all been there? Because really, every time we show it, it's so blurred. So thank you. We like to see clearly. Wow, I, I, I can't get over that. They cleaned their camera. I am impressed. I really am. Yeah. Um my little gym gym says that's okay you can you can try to tell people all you want they'll have to see for themselves they will they will wow thank you so much really thank you for cleaning your cameras really you are i am so thankful because um they didn't clean them before maybe i'm thinking about the wrong camera let me no i think it was this east one they didn't clean oh crud 
I think it was. Well, they can clean this one, too. I, maybe it was. No, this. how did it go on the North View, you all? The North View, we'll let you see the North View because it really doesn't have much going on with it. I mean, it has some activity, but not as much as the South. It has a lot of flashing of the lights and stuff like that going on. See, they're up there. These are the scientists. They're looking and looking and looking. Um... Those black things are ships, you all. They, they, they're hovering, hovering ships. Okay, you see the flashing of the light. So that this is the north view. Right behind it is the south view. It's this one right here. That's the dirty camera. I don't like that one. They got excited. They still need to fix it, you all. We just, you don't really see much from this. I mean, you see the sun. So that's what this camera looks like for some strange reason. And you really don't get too good of a view. East. Yeah, you can't see anything. So we're looking at this, you all. We just want to see if there's anything that shows up at night but you ain't gonna see it there's a sun up there that's it you are you're not gonna see nothing else so the big news is the south facing camera which is right here is where the UFO the big flying saucer UFO with the great big windows is at in Hawaii right there in the sky look at the lights going on you all and we can also if you just tuning in yeah it is real it's so real. Um, you can see these images right here of um, the flying saucer. It's right there. They even have like little notches in them and stuff. Isn't that amazing? Right at the observatory. Is this right in your face? Right in front of your camera. I hope you're out there on that balcony trying to contact and talk to them. If not, we can we can we can arrange from someone on this end to go have a talk we can we can arrange it we will arrange it uh, if they ask sure that's right we can do it we're nonpartisan. that's right boom um so you all look at that it's up there and then this is like massive ship coming through. That should this ship literally, it's from all the way over here, and it extends way back here. Way back here is the the length of that ship. That is massive. It's all the way over here. You can see the edges of it, and it is stretching all the way through here. Um, you can see it. That's how massive it is. Let me, um put this back to me I wanted to do one more thing I want let's look at the 4th of December just for the sake of it on the south facing camera we don't have to slow it down we don't you can see it see all that flashing of light so there's the bright light right there The scientists are up there um, because they're working today. They got a good vantage point. And um, let's see. You can see the brightness of it, you all. It's, it's the same patterns, too, that show up. See it up there? Boom. It is in the sky on the third. Let's go back to the second. It's in the sky on the third. You're off. You're just tuning in. We're just checking out the whole entire week. It's there right now. It's not the volcano. It's that flying saucer. It's made its presence known. It has. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's there. We're just going to wait for it to get dark because it's like 13 in the afternoon. 
see the vehicles? I think it's been here for some time. You know, I, I wondered why they were making it so blurred out at night. I really did. It's there on the... S okay, that's the second... The first. It's there. Oh, there it is, flying right above it. Look at it, hovering right above the observatory. Right there, as even as the clouds pass. So it's there on the first. We're just documenting the arrival of the flying saucer onto the camera. Is what we're doing. So you too can go there and you can you can hit the time lapse. You can. And you can watch it. You can watch it, you all. Look, there it is. It came back. Boom. And I think there's more than one. So that's the first. So here's the 30th of November. Oh. 30th. Wow. Now, see, that's very telling. Look at that. That's real telling. Right there. Wow. All that activity. It's wild, you all. So wild. Look at that. And it's so bright. Yeah, this is so fascinating. It really is. If it was the moon, <laughs> it wouldn't be doing that. That's the. We can only go back. We'll just go back. Uh, as far as it will let us document for documentation purposes, you all. That's right, for documentation purposes. See, this is the cloud. This is their cloaking. Just have a big snowstorm to try to cover up the huge flying saucer that's here because we don't want the people to know. Try to hide the light with a um, snowstorm on top of the observatory with the blinding snow. Maybe it was the UFO spinning around and created a whirlwind up here. Uh, maybe. Perhaps so. Yeah, I think that's what happened. It created a whirlwind. So it's there on the 29th also. When did the volcano erupt? Is the volcano a distraction? Uh, is it because they would have all eyes on Hawaii with the Moana Loa volcano erupting? Okay, we're on the 28th. It's as far as we can go back, you all. That's it. This is um, it. We got the snow going on. Rain. Just looking for any sign of light up there in the sky. Well, we know there's some kind of a light up there. Just got to watch it. Okay, yeah, it's there. Whew. Okay, it's there, you all. So, yeah, that's... um. If you were to go back to the fourth, this is the main video right here. This is what's behind us. This is where the UFO is at. You can see it. Uh, and at the 551 time stamp is when you can see the outline perfect. It's right up here. It's 532, 38, 43, 55, 555. I went too far. Um, it's right there. You can see it. It's 5202 and the UFO is still right up there. The flying saucer UFO. So, um, you know, this is, um, that's wild. Isn't it wild? Um, who was it that predicted uh, December the 8th? Somebody did a prediction on December the 8th of something about um, extraterrestrials, flying saucers, or UFOs on December the 8th. Because I remember hearing it during a live stream or reading it in a comment. 
um yeah hello yeah y'all we gotta go but y'all give this video a thumbs up you all and um there's somebody here something's here <laughs> right up there and um they know it and we know it we've known it for a while that there was something up there other than a volcano in the sky really um so um with that being said thank you and um hello wherever you are in any part of the world hello from my heart to yours love you have a wonderful rest of your um evening thank you moderators thank you for your comments and perhaps you've never seen videos like this before we've been documenting a lot of ufo activity at the observatories on this channel and we have a whole entire playlist playlist dedicated to the observatories thank you and um have a wonderful evening love you